Hi everyone! Welcome or welcome back to my channel. This is Leela Budgets. My name is Kalila. I am a mom of a one-year-old boy and a wife for the last four years. On my own time, outside of uh, co-developing, I love to cash stuff and budget um, and spend time with family and friends. And so if this is something you're looking for and is interested in, click like, subscribe, and let's get going with this cash condensing. So, I don't do many of these cash condensings. It really happens after I've accumulated enough. Um, usually, usually, it's about when I get 100 in each envelope or in multiple envelopes. And I like to do this to swap out real money with prop bills. Okay. And so first thing I want to start off with is, and stating is that I don't have any pretty nails today. I was so, I was debating, right? I'm going on my trip soon and I wanted to leave those nails for my trip, so I didn't do it. Um, but um, that's okay. And I have a quote for us today and hopefully this helps you with whatever you're going through in your life currently. And the quote is, it is better to look ahead and prepare than to look back and regret. And so often do I see so many um, cash stuffers on YouTube here. You know, they say they they feel bad. I, I feel bad too when I have to use money in my cash envelopes, right, for an emergency. But what we have to realize is we looked ahead to the future and we prepared and we saved enough so that we could avoid um, going into debt for emergencies, right? So that's where uh, the power comes from cash stuffing. So to, you know, continue looking ahead and prepare um, then looking back and regretting, you know, so that's how I can relate um, to that quote. And I thought that was just such a powerful reminder and that maybe someone needed to hear. All right, so let's start off with my pink binder, which is my long-term savings binder. And let's start off with home maintenance. Because I know I have 50s in here. Okay, so we have 100 in the bank. 50, 100, 120, 140, 160, 170. I'm going to take the 250s and grab a prop bill of 100. And we have 200, 220, 240, 260, 270. And I'll come back, come back and um, condense this more in a bit here. And then I have new car that has some big bills here. So the 50 I'm going to leave, but this is 100. Take that. Grab a hundred and now condense to one fifty. And then tech. Tech has 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 100 also. And I will be taking a prop bill and putting it in here. Anything that I have here will be taken back to my ally savings account. It's a high yield savings account. Okay, so we'll just start with that. And then I'm going to take my black binder here, which is my short-term seeking funds. And be looking to get some bigger bills from here. So Halloween has 100, 50, 70, 80, 90, 100. And then Thanksgiving also has 100, I believe, 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 85, 90, 95, 100. Thanksgiving has 100. And then Christmas also has a real 100. So the difference is these are real 100s, you can tell. 
These are just fake pop bells. I cut them on the side and they have stickers on it and they feel like paper. Um, so I will be putting this one away and putting in a pop bell. So I have 400 in Christmas. Okay. All right, so let's get going. I got a lot of bills out. Let's get going with my personal binder. I've been using a lot of money and cash lately, so I'm actually like done here, but I'm not worried because I'm going to go on my trip later this month of April and I will be um, using my travel money anyways, so it is okay. Um, this one is good. These are all empty. And like I said, I've been doing a lot of things. Um, HCA has 30, so we can't condense anymore. Emergency fund has these bills here, 20, 40, 60, 80. I'm just going to leave it until I hit another 100 there. Usually in my personal binder, I don't need to condense much because it's, I use the money anyways. Um, Caius, let's see. So 20, 130, so I'm gonna condense this. So now I have 140 in Caius. Coda, can't condense. Andy, let's see. He has 210. So I can do this. Parents has 200, 150, 250, 260, 270, 275. Condense this. Now I have 200, or I still have, but now it's condensed. Um, and I have 275. Date night has 20. Family has 23, so I will leave that. Birthday and gifts are empty. That is it for my family binder. And we'll go back to my long-term thinking fun binder. Kids future. 20, 40, 50. So how is everyone doing? It's only been a week since my last video, but I definitely already miss um, doing videos. I feel like this is a safe space and, you know, I can be myself with y'all. So thank you for making me feel comfortable and open. 20, 40, 60, 70. Let's take this. We just did this, but 20, 40, 50, last 50 there. Yeah, so I have been so busy at work, um, but you know, I have just really just learned to kind of settle, um, and I'm at the point where my in my life where I'm content. Uh, when people ask if you're happy, I usually, you know, answer with I'm content, right? Because being happy is a temporary feeling, right? You're never going to feel happy forever. Um, but being content with your life, that just means so much more. 
And I think when you finally go through your life and you've worked so dang hard for what you have, then you know what being content really means. Being grateful for what you have. Um, so I recently learned that. Being content is better than anything, right? Um, these were all contents already. Challenges. Fifty or five. Ten, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen. Change this for ten. And I who's updated with Queen of Tears. Um, I am, but uh, that Korean drama on Netflix, Queen of Tears, has just taught me so much. I talked about it in my last video. But it just taught me so much about life and how you always have to put in work into your marriage, into any type of relationship that you're in. Um, that doesn't, you know, it doesn't matter if it's a friend or with your sister, with your mom, your dad. You know, just really... Um, you know, put in the work and love each other because life is truly, really short, right? I think sometimes in mainstream or like on social media, you just see, you forget, right? When you're on social media, it looks like everyone is happy and everything and you forget that we're all, you know, um, here to live our lives and we all have our own exits in life and one day we will be gone from this earth and how do you want to be remembered how do you want to live your life um so remembering to forgive and to apologize and you know talk with love rather than hate that is something that should be done more and i am learning too so i just like to preach on that because you know you you Manifest what you talk about and what you think about and so thinking positively like that and trying to better myself and people around me um, Yeah So Home decor 20 30 40 50 55 60. I'm going to just 30 40 And then travel, I'm going to leave travel. Halloween already did, Thanksgiving already did, Christmas already did. That's the last one. 20, 30, 31, 32, 34, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 40. Other day is house 40. All right. And so that is it for my cash condensing video. If you enjoyed it, please give me a thumbs up or like um, and subscribe to my channel. I am so, so close to 100 subscribers and I may or may not do a giveaway when we hit 100, but I will see um, how busy I am. Um, but thank you so much for your support, for your kind words. I love this community and I love being a part of it. And so thank you. Thank you for being a part of my journey um, and my life on YouTube. See you all next time. Bye.